uh, it will show what we bought. Yep. I am totally correct. We've bought this one more, one more table right here and a few chairs. Aha, looking good, right? And good day, everyone. Snack here and welcome back to Chef RPG. As you can see here, we are, uh, it's early morning around eight and uh, we have a cutscene with Hazel. So she's saying I wanted to stop by and uh, see how everything is going. When do you think you'll open the restaurant? That food you made me was delicious. Now that you have your refrigerator working i assume it'll be soon okay so uh, i only have like one table and two chairs at the moment i'm not sure if i'm ready to open it uh but we need to uh at least uh make sure that the restaurant is prepared so let's just go ahead and explore white ash harbor first uh that's great there's a lot of it to explore around this area i'm sure you want to think about your menu some more and gather up more ingredients definitely we'll do that you guys after today talk to me when you are ready to do this soft opening i can invite everyone who helped you get started in might of ash in in white bash harbor no no i mean <laughs> white ash harbor they are all really really excited to try your food see you later i'm off to go collecting strawberries with boba <laughs> all right that's cool so uh we'll make sure guys that we are fully prepared before we do a soft opening this first impression is always uh, very important you know so um we do have i do have a meal planned let's see okay we'll work on that later on so our main course is gonna be most likely a uh, garlic peasant uh, dish yes we have its recipe and also uh it's easy to hunt some peasants although they're hard to target because they just fly away um i would like uh, the boar because we have a lot of boar meat uh let's see yeah this it's in my fridge but we don't have the recipe for the boar meat yet for the appetizer a uh, watercress salad would be uh cool and we also have a recipe for a dessert an apple pie and uh, a sweet tea and a dark berry punch for the beverage all right so first let's head straight to uh, the gallery because i wanted to check out more furnitures for our uh, restaurant uh let's check first the task board okay this is cool uh Thaleo wants to make a bet with an experienced hunter hunt red peasants within the time limit when apprised within four days and we're planning to uh get more peasants so we'll go ahead with this it's in line with our current plan for the restaurant so that should be our best route oh we have Taleo here oh i think we oh not not yet <laughs> we still need to hunt four of them and we are here in la gallery we visited la gallery earlier but it seems that there was no one here hopefully this time no okay correct me if i'm wrong you guys i believe this is the place where we, where we could buy some furniture so it's uh 10 a.m and by the way regarding the time uh i was confused uh on the previous video uh, about the time because it was 7 a.m and it was still dark but i think it's just how it is in the game it's accurately 7 a.m and uh the stores usually uh will open 7 30 a.m to 4 p.m on weekdays that means no saturday and sundays i believe uh when i commented at that time it was a saturday that's why no one is opened yet also so my bad it was my mistake and let's see okay so there's nothing going on in lag gallery i'm not sure uh, oh, oh yeah today is a sunday man i should have read more i should learn how to read right let's see the time of the gallery the office hours so yep they are open only weekdays 10 a.m so i think this time is hunting time although it's raining but it should be a perfect time to hunt the those uh peasants and i think we can hunt them here at this side let's just go and, and fast travel and head straight left so as you can see i'll show you guys our restaurant at the moment we only have like we do have eloise here uh, our uh, server and we are the cook here at this time we only have one table and two chairs as i said so we need more of it if we want to accommodate all the people and uh, also i'm planning to meet this uh veteran hunter i forgot her name i think she is living somewhere here at this place so we'll head straight i want to learn hunting it's actually one of my best one of my favorite activities aside from fishing and farming oh hey here we have bo here well hello there young one here to sample some of our fish freshly caught this morning oh you are the new chef taking over at Lisikoya. fantastic my name is bowie come by if you need some any you need any fresh seafood all right sure bowie and along the way let's just cut these uh mushrooms they should be very uh fresh especially it's raining perfect for our 
uh, dishes. They also have these. Uh, what are these guys? Oh, we have these elder berries. Yummy. And this place looks like it's it's a there's a garden here. April's greenhouse. It's locked. Okay. I think uh, we can actually uh there there is a. Uh, uh, farming element of the game but not that much in a form of a greenhouse also locked so it's a f in the form of a greenhouse so that's gonna be fun right and uh, we have a boar right here uh, but we are looking for a peasant this one let's focus on our task but let's just get get these uh, fresh red apples first make sure the boar will not notice us and pick up this egg wow this is fun and let's just aim straight to these peasant all right there you go see it's it's gonna okay it's gonna fight and it ran away oh nice uh, we just hit that peasant from from far away so there's one more here in the meantime let's pick up this uh these uh chilies there should be one more uh peasant hide in here or it could it, i think it hid somewhere oh man anyway uh it's fine we'll we're picking up a lot of stuff along the way so it's fun oh hold on this one i think we could uh, uh we could uh, use our scythe to cut this yeah i think so let's see uh Oh, there you go. It took a lot of it, a lot of strikes from our scythe, and we got five sugar cane. That is so cool. All right, finally, I learned something really useful. You need to read. Again, I, I should learn how to read because uh, I was actually doing this. If I want to change my uh, rod to a scythe, I actually go to menu and then manually grab it like that. But you can actually press Q. Get this, guys. It's so convenient, and I was doing it for the first two playthroughs. So uh, we have a boar here. Uh, I don't need a boar yet. I just need a peasant. So oh, there's an elk, but uh, I think they're a bit strong for uh, at the moment. All right. So I'm I'm hoping that these guys are not aggressive. Let's just pick up some stuff. We have oh, we have a uh, asparagus. Wow, this white ash harbor has a bounty full of uh, forages. Pretty awesome, right? We also have a flower. Uh, maybe we could use our scythe to cut this flower uh nada nothing's happening let's just pick up more uh wild carrot we have an egg here and uh we have oh we have mushrooms cool oh a lot of mush mushrooms here i think we are in the swampy area at this side uh, instead of looking for peasants we are now uh foraging our way towards success <laughs> well we could definitely use these um yummy forages in our dishes so why not right and uh since we're here let's go ahead and grab all these mushrooms although i need to be mindful because it's like 5 p.m we only got like two peasant meat oh hold on wait ah all right all right so uh our energy is now low every time we hit uh, we, we use uh, a tool that requires energy it will lower down our energy more like there is a penalty so we need to be very careful let's see if uh oh boy i was supposed to hunt a peasant but uh, uh can we eat our one of the apples oh okay we can put it here uh well i want to use the mushroom and so we have a, a, month, a lot of mushrooms right now so we could i think we could eat one of it uh okay it's a brown mini mushroom so okay one i'll press one uh was it consumed uh nothing happened like hold on uh, okay i should read again i should learn how to read so it's just a vegetable that doesn't add any thing except for the apple let's do apple this time it will add like uh three uh stamina actually what's uh oh well, well we'll go with this okay let's uh consume the apple let's look at the e bar below oh there you go that's good but uh <laughs> oh man i'm not sure if that's the optimal way to consume uh food to get stamina because it just adds very little and there is a cool time a cool down as well so it's not that optimal just eat more apple good thing these guys are not aggressive at all so um oh finally we have a peasant now let's see if if yeah i'm pretty sure that we need also stamina to uh okay i think i'm about to faint again let's eat more apple and the peasant is gone oh here she is make sure to be patient and there you go we have a total of five peasants okay let's reserve our energy uh i think uh the best food we have for now for stamina is this carrot so let's just move it here just like that and there you go oh also when we we're foraging it will okay every time you pick up things as well it will deduct stamina or energy so it looks like the only thing we could really do now is to uh, hunt some peasants i think this is the place where you know i mentioned earlier that we need to meet the veteran hunter if you want to get serious in hunting i think this is the place because look at this there's uh there's a zone for uh, archery training there's also another house here which is so cool man this houses here reminds me of the hobbit i uh, like this one here from uh the shire which is so cool man and uh let's see uh let's read hunt 
Factorium. Open weekdays, 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Okay, let's see what we can hunt here at this time. I'm looking for a peasant. We also have this uh, honey bee. Uh, yeah, well, we'll just get get this one. It's free food. So we have here a place where we could hunt. Uh, hopefully we could find a peasant. There's a boar there. I don't need that. It takes a lot of uh, energy and time to uh, hunt a boar because they are very sturdy. Uh, I need a peasant. Well, at least we have an egg and there is a peasant. Nice. Let's eat some carrots first. Hunt that peasant down. I cannot. I couldn't see it. There, there she is. Uh huh. Oh, there she is. And there you go. One hit, second hit, and the third hit. Oh man, that hurts. Oh boy. All right, we have like uh, I think we have a total of nine raw peasant meat. Not bad. Uh, it's still uh almost 9 p.m. I think we still have more time to hunt uh more peasants, but uh we need to be very uh mindful of our energy because we are running low of it. I don't want to faint again and pay uh, a lot of credits in the hospital. And I think we're gonna get this guy here. One more hit and done. Haha, <laughs> nice. We've hunted four peasants and we've completed the Leo's I think, uh, yeah, that is the Leo's um, uh, task for us. And I think oh, we also have a skill point and abil uh, uh, ability point available. Cool. Uh, I think we need more endurance. Uh, not really. I wanted to. Hmm, let me think. It's easy to uh, kite these guys without being hit. Uh, so I'll go ahead with uh, social. Let's do social, right? And then, um, oh, all right, well, bookworm. Yeah, I'm gonna take this. You might discover new recipes in reading library book. This is this one's cool. Okay, but we need to SP for this skill point. All right, uh, we're gonna get all the skills that requires one uh, skill point for now. Line cook. It will add 15% cooking speed when player is cooking. This should help us save time, be effective and efficient. Okay, not bad. And it, oh boy, it's so dark. Uh, let's head home. And uh, we could. Good thing we could. Uh, we, we took the perk that allows us to travel home as quickly as possible. Let me show you guys this perk here. Explorer, your knowledge of the land allows you to fast travel back to your home quickly. And let's just set aside our um. <laughs> our our the things that we've got for today and our new friend and uh tomorrow we're gonna set up our furniture so we have here look at this you man you guys we have a lot of things that we could i think uh hopefully we have more space left and there you go all right let's just do some inventory we have like uh 60 uh plus mushroom we have a lot of it we have a lot of eggs as well at least we have these guys as our toppings and also this one will add a more character in our dish the egg uh but we need our main uh, meat is the boar meat we have 50 of it but we don't have the, its recipe yet so we'll go ahead with uh peasants okay sounds like a plan so uh right now it's 11 p.m it's a sunday so uh well i guess we'll head straight home and get some rest and tomorrow uh we're gonna uh go and check out la gallery and hopefully we'll get ourselves some nice uh, furniture for our restaurant and good night everybody and by the way guys thank you so much for being here and if you're new feel free to like and subscribe i would really appreciate that a lot all right we are now on the eighth day to monday 7 30 a.m and again uh i think uh, I, I I can confirm that at 7 a.m., 7.30 a.m., in this game, it's still a bit dark. There's no sunshine yet. So um, it's like uh, we're going... Uh, yeah, because uh, it's... it's I started in winter. Could be because of that, right? Because... Uh, we just it just we just came from uh no i started in spring so we just came from win winter so maybe the sun is not yet aw fully awake from winter so because it's a spring so maybe that's the case well at least that's the case here in our place okay uh we'll head straight to uh phileo's place and uh complete the quest and right after that we'll check out la a gallery okay we have here um a lemon okay uh, we'll go ahead with this delivery task is easy and uh it's within uh the, the area where we are going so i think that's the best task we can do for today and hello delayo i got something for you and there you go aha oh, okay it's a random recipe oh we have 27 potato that's awesome potato is always useful we can do a lot of dishes with these with these uh round potatoes and then uh we're gonna head straight to uh the la gallery first oh what's this guy oh oh we have melo yeah we're gonna deliver it delivery for Milo's secret pen pile <laughs> okay and uh oh, hold on hold on uh, let me just to the train station post post office so now we are currently 
you will oh, you will automatically fail the daily task if you drop the parcel okay uh, uh we'll, we'll go straight to the post office then uh where is that train okay uh at this side here at the east side hello melu what a fresh produce hello nabias could we pick up without dropping the parcel uh let's see nope nope makes sense makes sense i'm glad that it didn't pick it up it's <laughs> it would be uh be very unrealistic so now uh okay we need to go here i thought we could go from this side here at the forest but we can't so we'll go straight all right so as you can see here um there is a a, a directions that where we could go um if you see here at the this side there is a bath house this is one of the best places that we could go in the game actually uh if you've watched uh ghibli studio spirited away uh, yep, this game is also inspired by that. In fact, yeah, we, why not? Let's. Oh, no dress fasting. Oh, it seems that it is not yet open. Well, uh, I'm excited at the, about how we are gonna be of help to open this bathhouse. Looks like it's dilapidated as of the moment, just like a restaurant. Oh, oh well, this is so cool. I <laughs> can't wait to contribute to its. Uh, uh, opening again okay uh, for the meantime let's head straight to the post office and we are here uh okay this is the drop box okay oh just like that we've dropped it parcel oh all right well we have the tickets let's say hi ah uh, it's just information okay and oh we have some few vending machines right here we can buy all this stuff so it's now 11 and 11 a.m uh, let me see what we could we could uh see here nope there's no train at all it's gonna be uh wait arrival time uh, okay they will be arriving at 10 p.m hmm. it would be cool if uh, i'm gonna check it out if there's indeed a train that will arrive at that time and you know what you guys for uh er for an early access um chef rpg really 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 uh exceeded my expectation is uh, look at this Th the city is so vibrant everything is moving there's some leaves falling grasses dancing trees dancing along with the leaves and the people here are are just walking around uh they have their own thing i just want to say i really like your hair oh thank you you too and we have a peasant nice maybe we could uh hunt a little bit uh I think we are at the Takashi farm. This is where Mei Lu lives, I think. Yep. And we are about to get ourselves some peasant meat. Ah! Oh, oh boy. Oh, there he is. All right. More peasant meat for our restaurant. Oh boy. Let's just get this meat first before another another predator could claim our our uh, our meat. And uh, which, this should end the hunt. Aha. Cool. Okay. And since we are by the beach, let's just head straight here. We have some crabs. It's now 1 a.m. Ah, uh, man. I really wanted to hunt more, but it seems that uh i need to prioritize getting getting uh uh some furniture for our uh, restaurant but along the way let's just pick up these uh clam the seaweed should not take much of our time and also maybe uh get these uh mushrooms oh we have uh an eight uh eight 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 eight, eight twelve there if there is seven eleven there is eight twelve <laughs> all right we have here um who's this guy couldn't talk to him no this one all right Oh, L10. Hello. 811. Okay, it's 811. That sounds fun. All right, let's head straight now to La Gallery and Fast so that finally we could uh, choose uh, the best furnitures that we could afford for our restaurant. But we'll meet uh, Milo or Milo. Milo. I think it's Milo. Milo first to get our reward. Let's see. Oh, we have 33 seaweeds. Nice. That is so convenient. And uh, finally, we are here and uh, someone should be available. Oh, there he is. Hello, Henry. I need uh, to shop more uh, table for a former restaurant. So we have four types. White cloth table, uh, rustic style, a bit expensive, 300 credit though. Uh, well, I think we'll go ahead with the white cloth table. So white cloth table and this maple chair is it's the cheapest. <laughs> uh, he's also selling this blender, uh, charcoal grill, uh, ice cream maker. Wow, this is so cool, you guys. Look at these. We also have a uh, floor uh, blueprints right here and a uh, few uh, decoration and a uh, heater. Nice. And also some plants. This is so cool. I uh, can't wait for us to beauty beautify our restaurant and also our home. I think this is for our home as well. So in the meantime, let me just grab a few of these uh, dining tables. Okay, we've bought one. I think we need uh, three of these and uh, yeah, already have two, right? So one, two. All right, that should do it. Hold on. Uh, we bought 
but we bought the chairs and the tables but i couldn't see them in our inventory uh how does it work how does it work uh maybe they will deliver it directly to our uh, restaurant uh we'll see oh i think uh yeah i think i got it i got this right maybe if we just open our uh build uh option let me show you guys once we open this one uh, it will show what we bought yep i am totally correct we've bought this one more one more table right here and a few chairs aha looking good right aha this is so cool man it's so satisfying that you'll be able you're i'm able to this game allows us to decorate our uh dream restaurant at least in the game for now and there you go that should complete it and oh wow looking good look at this all right i think we are ready to do a soft opening tomorrow we have all our ingredients here a lot of them in fact let's just i'll transfer all of them first in our refrigerator i i think it's too late to do a soft opening so we're gonna do it tomorrow so what else we could do in uh as of the moment to uh to beautify our restaurant maybe we could uh get some plants i think we still have a uh, space for more uh tables let me try this uh layout although this part here may look weird oh yeah i don't uh, yeah it looks weird but um by doing so we could put more uh two more tables all right you guys it's now 4 p.m i'm not sure if that gallery is still open oh hey hazel uh well later on uh maybe tomorrow we're gonna open and do a soft opening in our restaurant hazel i um, can't wait to serve the people of white ash harbor it seems that uh they've been looking forward to the reopening of the sequoia oh we have a recreational center let's see Oh, cool. Okay. Uh, is there any uh, membership needed for us to use the equipment? Uh, we also have a washroom right here. Uh, this looks so cool. That seagull took my phone. <laughs> All right. So we still have, uh, it's still 5 p.m. Uh, but uh, I wanted to get more ingredients for our uh, restaurant. So we'll just go ahead and uh, do some fishing. Although I find fishing in this game kind of challenging. Uh, we'll, we'll see. Hopefully I'll, I'll, I'll do good at this time. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. See, I, I'm not really good at this. Okay. Ah, no. My fishing rod might be too weak. Could be. But uh, it's just that, that I, I haven't really figured out the fishing mechanic of this game. And we have a bite. I need a stronger fishing rod. Okay. Where could we get a stronger fishing rod then? Yeah, I, I just couldn't could be that uh, we need a stronger fishing rod indeed so what we can do at this time 6 p.m oh okay um looks like uh bianca is not yet here i was thinking of uh getting from her uh the the one that it, it's looks like it looks like a glow ring oh here's bianca yep <laughs> we can say hi to her she's a bit busy and uh yeah i wanted to get a glow ring at least at night while hunting we uh light and uh also maybe a uh, uh hand a drill because uh we might need to get some ores to up do some upgrades but we'll do that later on and say hi to Bea first idiot what i don't understand this i wasn't talking about you but someone else who shall remain a nameless okay she has a lemon uh wheat and uh barley and the rest of this stuff okay you know what what uh we still have like a uh, few time a few uh hours left in game so we'll just go ahead and uh do some night hunting let's go uh do you know how can i get to billboard city yeah yeah okay looks like you know your way towards there let's just grab these uh raspberries and some chilies we also have here uh beehive that we could grab a honeycomb from it and also this sugar cane chop and there you go we have more chilies right here oh it's a bit dark how i wish i bought that uh glow ring at least oh we've upgraded our foraging i think so we are now getting all these wild carrots which is the main source of our ener energy and also uh we could use it for uh for one of our ingredients and we have an elk here i don't want to mess with the elk because uh i think they're very sturdy they're hard they're, they they're they have high uh health so it will take time for us to hunt them down at least these uh peasants only takes three to four hits and they are not that aggressive when we hunt them down okay where is that peasant it's gone oh boy it went away so it's almost 10 p.m oh we also have this uh, uh water crest that we could pick up nice oh boy i can't wait while i am picking up all these forages and hunting down the uh wildlife i'm thinking already of how to cook him and uh what dish i could make for my 
fellow friends in White Ash Harbor. Oh boy, my heart just jumps like literally even if I know it's only a game but it excites it excites me a lot that I could get to cook for the people and make their uh day satisfied at least when it comes to my cooking there you go there you go oh boy that is we got i think that was a critical hit from the person and it is now gone okay oh boy let's just grab all these elderberries and also we have here a beehive there you go we have some honeycomb do more elderberries it's, all, it's always good oh here is the person look at this you guys although it it may look like it ran away but it was just here it did not regenerate its health it's like it i could say that the hunting mechanic of this game is is uh, is really good is although it's not the 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 kind of a uh, hunting mechanic that it's almost like an, in in a realistic way but gets you in a hunting mode like we really want to get rid of the that uh, animal that you're hunting is it runs away just like that and it runs away from random places and you need to track it down where it went and when you see it it has low health that means uh it's the one that you've hunted and it's it's it gives me that sense of satisfaction that i was able to finally hunt it down after after looking for it in the meantime let's just pick up these uh, asparaguses and there's a lot of carrots here oh man i want to pick up everything hopefully i won't faint let's see hopefully i won't faint you guys oh, jo oh boy and look at that <laughs> we just fainted and uh looks like we're gonna pay some hefty amount of credits and there we are again we are being scolded by valentina as always <laughs> uh, 133 credits okay that's uh sounds fair okay at least we've got some asparagus and uh wild carrots from that it was a good trade although uh not really that good if we do it habitually because it will our health will be deteriorated if we always have less sleep so now seems that today is a new day and also if we uh faint or we will wake up late now it's 10 a.m so for more videos guys you could look at the lower part of the screen if you're new feel free to like and subscribe thank you again so much for hanging out uh please do stay tuned uh we're gonna do uh our next episode of this um uh, awesome game that I, I i think it will really go to the places where stardew valley uh graveyard keeper is already at it will be one of those games that you know that will stay it will be an evergreen game that's what i believe it has a huge potential so do check it out do a wish list or even buy this game this 12th of september and don't forget again that this is all it's also in an early access so we have to be very considerate and provide constructive criticisms and all this good stuff thank you again and see you on the next video